How's it going, YouTube? Cody Bernardi here with a mullet, kind of. I'm I'm growing it. It's going to go to my shoulders. I'm super stoked about it. Don't don't hate on me for that. Anyways, uh, today we are going to be taking a look at this new tool set that Michael Bazell, for those that don't know, he is the author of the Open Source Intel Techniques book, which if y'all have not purchased yet, I have a link down below. It's an affiliate link to Amazon, of course. I get a little bit of money with it so just full disclosure on that no added price to you uh just tendies in my pocket uh first off crack open a topo um so he tweeted this out i think yesterday um saying three years ago we were bullied into taking our search tools offline threatened with lawsuits and suspended by our web host today the tools return with updates free for everyone. New feature soon. Details on Friday's show. Please be responsible. Awesome. I love it. I personally, I have not used um, any of these. Uh, I think I, I, I truly got into OSINT right around the time this site probably got taken offline, um, like producing YouTube videos and stuff like that. So we're going to take, uh, take a look at this ourselves see what we can use with it uh, and, and just walk through it because I'm I'm super happy to have something like this. I know OSINT Framework is ran by Lockvail. I don't know the last time the actual OSINT Framework was updated. Okay, so May 15th, they had a pull request that was updated, but they also have 47 open pull requests. It's not updated as frequent as I would like it to. I mean, obviously you see pull requests from 2019 in here, so... Um, it's just best practice if you're not going to include it in the in the actual tool, just close it out. Anyways, um, so we'll go ahead and take a look at this uh, Intel Techniques um, tool set right here. So first things first, uh, I'll put a link to this down below. So uh, we have a few things in here. So let's click on search engines. Let's start start from the top down. So the latest Island Boys video was popping off. So I, I I'm going to stick with that. I'm going to stick with wrappers for the meantime. Uh, popular rappers. I know I made that like OSINT video on like that random kid that like paid for a sponsored Instagram ad, all that sh stuff. I'll stay, I'll stay away from that for now. I'm going to stick with well-known people. So um, let's just start off with the Island boys. Let's put that in quotes and see what this does for us. So it says populate all. And I, I believe what this does for us is it just, if we were to click on like Google or Yandex, it's just going to search it for us. So let's go ahead and click on that. Opens up a new tab. That's pretty much what that one does. It's pretty straightforward. That's awesome. Uh, we also have tour sites. I actually did not see this the first time I went through this site. Like I skimmed over it the first time. Uh, let's see if it actually opens up tour. Um, I don't expect it to open up tour. So I would encourage you to go ahead and run those in the Tor browser itself, not on, uh, you know, Firefox or something like that. Okay, moving on. Let's go ahead and take a look at Firefox. So Facebook username. I believe this is good with like the user ID on the top. So we will go ahead and go on Facebook real quick and see what we can find. All right, I'm going to pick this one right here. This is obviously not him. But we'll go ahead and take that Facebook profile ID right there and populate all. So if we were to click on timeline, it's going to bring us straight to the timeline. If we go back here and we go to sports, it's going to take to the sports that they might like. Uh, let's see. Let's see what they have likes on. This page is available. Um, actually, let's go ahead and refresh this one real quick. So Facebook username. Interesting. Um, let's see if we can find like a wide open Facebook. Um, let's try to Compton files. Uh, let's go to likes. I don't know if that's going to populate or not. So the link uh, has been removed. So it's Compton files likes. Um, see if we could find someone else. Who's like a famous like Martin Shkreli? Yeah, and we go to people real quick, and let's let's just click on one of these and see if there's like any likes, 
I think this is like what it's doing right here. So I'm just gonna do a sanity check and like go to music, sports, and nothing to show there. I'm just gonna pick an account that might have something. Okay, so I'm picking a random stranger. I'm not gonna look into them. I just, I need, I need to validate something. So we'll go here, we'll go to likes. Okay, so we know this person right here has likes on their public Facebook, all that. Um, so if we were to go up here, populate all, and go to, um, we just check likes. Okay, cool. So that's how that works. So it will only populate something if obviously it has to be public. So this is this is just a quick way for you to get access to these things. So like if you don't want to play around with like the Facebook page and like click on photos and videos and all that, this is the best place to do that. But of course, you will get that error page uh, if they don't have anything in there, if they haven't liked anything or if they haven't actually publicly made, you know, made their profile public. Okay, moving on to Twitter. So Twitter username, this one's very easy. We will use mine. If you do not follow me yet on Twitter, uh, it is at Twitter support, T-U-W-T-T-E-R support. I support Twitter, uh, Twitter itself. So if you need assistance with anything, uh, feel free to reach out to me it's uh, at, or no, sorry, twittersupport.com. That is our ticket intake queue. Uh, we will help you out with your tickets and all that. Uh, otherwise, you could reach out to us directly onto Twitter support. Okay, so um, we'll populate these all. So we'll see Twitter profile, outgoing tweets, uh, TB user data, interesting. Bing archives, Google text, Google cache. Let's see what this has. So this actually brings you to a cached version of their page. Wow. Um, I don't know when this was cached. I think that might give you that information, but that's actually really helpful because unless you know the like Google dorks cache, it's, it's, it's literally just cache colon. Um, that's actually really nice. And then I don't know what Spoonbill is. Never heard of it. Um, Oh, so, oh, yo, hey, that's kind of that. Th I've never heard of this site before, by the way. So it tells you like, um, like any changes they make to their profile. So like for me, I changed my location from, uh, the upside down question mark to hell. And then I changed my bio from currently not taking a new tickets to whatever that is. Um, Wow. I've never heard of I've never heard of Spoonbill before, but that's actually <laughs> that's really helpful. Holy, um, awesome! Never heard of Spoonbill. Ten ten will probably do something uh, with that account. Now we have like Wayback Machine right here. Let's see if anyone's way back to me before. We have a couple in twenty twenty one. Nice. We have four. I don't know who's doing this. Maybe it's just a crawler, but that's cool. Official Twitter support. Um, wow. And look at that. That's not even my current profile pic. So this is super helpful, by the way. Um, Twitter audit, friend analysis, social bearing. I've heard of those sites before. Uh, media tweets. So it just clicks on the media uh, thing for you. Um, again, like you can do that yourself, but I feel like these outgoing tweets might be helpful. Okay. So let's, let's skip on, uh, let's skip on down to Instagram. So Bing search Instagram profile channel tagged. Okay. So y'all get the, y'all get the gist of this. Um, let's see documents. Oh, I think this is Google searches. So search terms, let's put in, uh, confidential that's always fun to search and then it will google i believe this will just google search with like file type or ext.pdf oh my god yo this is so nice i love this michael bazell you killed it i know this is like all known info but this just makes things so much easier what is this uh amazon aws stuff oh Yo, man, that's dirty. That's dirty. So it's like checking S3 buckets and stuff. Oh, 
Wow. And it does that on Google Docs, Google Drive, Google API. <laughs> oh, man. This site. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> oh, I love this. Some video streams. Um, what does this mean? <laughs> Baltimore launch? I don't know what that, what, what, what do the cities mean? Tonight. And Aaron, uh, National Weather Service Holy being shit. proactive. They're going to go ahead and issue an alert later for everyone. When this is just str like live news. Come forward. That's what our hope is. I know you want to wrap this up. Wow. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> oh, weather radio, marine radio, amateur radio, railroad radio, aviation radio, and then emergency services. So it's going to be like Broadcastify and stuff like that. Oh, wow. Virtual currencies. Bitcoin address. <sighs> Images. Bing, Tenai, Yandex, Karma Decay. Never heard of that one before. That's going to be like pay spin, go spin, all that stuff. Ooh. Did I load that one up right? Test. Uh, one, two, three. Hmm. Is this just searching for GitHub Gists? I don't know. How he say just Gist? I don't know. Interesting. IP addresses. Um, huh. The do this documents one is pretty nasty. Not gonna lie. Bug bounty people, if you're looking for a, a quick and dirty way to find some like corporate secrets and stuff like that, <laughs> I mean, this is all Google dirt dorks for the most part. This is amazing. Wow. Okay. Well, I mean, I didn't provide any other value other than just like go through some of these, but um, yeah, it, this is huge. Like, I mean, this just. This just speeds up what I would normally do. That's the thing. Like, this isn't meant to, like, boil up new info. I mean, obviously, like, I learned some new sites going through here. Like, I've never heard of. Um, like, I'm, I'm currently on the uh, file search stuff. Like, I've never heard of author stream or slide bean. I've never heard of these before. But that's awesome because now I have, like, a new website that i could go to when i'm searching for things so definitely pocket this website when you're doing like trace labs and and other investigations because this is awesome so thank you so much michael bazell for providing for blessing us with this website again um anyways that is it for this video if y'all enjoy content like this please hit the thumbs up button hit the subscribe button with the bell notification enabled so you can get notified anytime i post a new video uh, currently, I am hunting down a new rapper to search for, um, so leave a comment down below if there's any rappers that you want me to investigate or any high-profile celebrities. Um, I've been thinking like Dan Bilzerian and Floyd Mayweather, so if y'all would want me to make a video on you know, the whereabouts of Floyd Money Mayweather or Daniel Bilzerian, let me know. You know, it's, it's something I've been thinking about. Anyways, that's it for this video. Y'all take care. Goodbye.